Alright, I'm gonna show you guys how to put videos on Sony Milo. So first, first thing you have to get is 3GP converter. Google it, open Google and search it. It should be the first one. It should be from um, DVX the little line thing. As you can see here, this little line digest.com. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Open it. And go all the way down. Download. Right there. Download it. Remember, this is all free. So, yeah, just click here to download. So, click there. Um, I'm sorry, my computer's slow. So, yeah, just click, click that. It'll show up like this, so I'm just gonna save it. I already have it, but I'll still save it so I can show you guys how to do it. Uh, save it in my desktop, I guess. It, sh it shouldn't take that long. Alright. So once that's downloading, you should like give you this is for like YouTube videos, but you can do it with other videos if you find a way to do it. You can go like movie movie links google that and you can get free movies but for right now I'm gonna you do YouTube videos Alright, just search any video you want. Okay, let's just put... Search up something, something small so I can just show you this. Uh, this will be a okay in 7, 17 seconds. Yeah, just go to mediaconverter.org. Alright. This is free too. You only have five conversions a day that you can so you just enter a link. Paste. Press OK. Oops. Remove one. Go to the next step. Um, you should put it to a video file. We should VLF. I don't. I just comfortable with that and just start already. Oh, and it failed. Well, it should work for you guys, but there's just something wrong. I did something. So yeah. So I was gonna show you how just to convert videos. So enough with this. There we go. I already have it, so. Should go down here. Alright. Uh, 
Oops. Alright, and you should open setup exe. And you should go all the way down for model P MP4 for PSP direct rename. Not the not for PSP but direct rename. For PSP direct rename. And yeah, okay. And make sure it's in English because it might be in Japanese or Chinese. Just apply. Open this one I guess. And it should be QVGA slash 2.929, I mean, sorry, QVGA slash 29.97 FPS slash T768 KBPS stereo slash 128 KBPS. Let's just get a video you want. Alright, so let me see. Let's say we want to get. I gotta have a video here. Alright, so just drag, like, you know, the file you get. Try it here. Make sure you have, like, this thing. Output directory. You should make it to your desktop or a folder you want. And yeah, so once you get that, oh, I'm sorry. Once you get the output directory, mine was this one. So yeah, you should get the the video and an HTML M file. Okay, so you try those into your Milo. But it has to be in a specific folder. I'll show you guys how to make that right now. Okay. So my model doesn't want to connect. Or I just don't have it right now. So. It has to be in. Okay, has to be the folder has to be MP little line thing root and another folder called 100 MNV01 and then your video should be there with the both the movie and the THM file and it should work. So I'll put everything you guys need on the description and yep.